Hi friends, welcome to my channel. Today we'll see how to do the appear and disappear trick without using a green screen. Now to do that you have to shoot a raw footage. Make sure you shoot with a stool. Sit properly so that the parts of the stool is not visible. Do the trick and finally make sure to remove both the stool and yourself from the picture. Keep the video running for as long as you had the video before. Now after that get the raw footage into your timeline. Cut it into two parts. One where the trick is. Take the razor tool and cut where the trick begins till the trick ends. Switch back to this tool and remove unnecessary footage. Now the second footage where you have removed the chair, cut it again for almost the same duration and remove the unwanted footage. Now place the footage one below the other. Place the empty footage below and the footage which in which you appear at the top. Remove the audio. So we don't need it now. We will add the audio later. If you are speaking something then you might have to keep the audio. Make this slightly longer so that it, you can see appearing and disappearing. Now if you play you appear and then you disappear but there is a stool at the bottom or the chair legs at the bottom that you have to remove. Now for that you have to draw a mask around using the pen tool. So go to effects control. Click on the pen tool. and create a mask. You, you don't have to be very strict as the background is not moving. You have to be very thorough here so that the stool doesn't appear. Since the hand moves here you have to make sure you give enough space. Now the chair is gone. If you play you should see you appearing without the chair. As simple as that the trick is ready. Now to make fade in and fade out in the beginning and end just add an opacity. Add a key in the first frame and make the opacity zero so that in the beginning it's nothing is visible. Move this cursor to 5 to 6 frames and make it 100%. Now it will give you the fade look. Do the same at the end. Mark a point here with 100% and then at the end as 0%. So that it goes from 100 to 0 in the last few frames. Now to make it little more realistic you can add a shadow down at the bottom since it's visible for others. One more thing you have to make sure that you have to shoot that shadow is not seen. If the shadow is visible then you will not be able to edit it properly. Now we can add a shadow to this. To add a shadow hold down the alt key and create a duplicate of this. We'll add the shadow at the bottom. Uncheck this uniform scale. Move the position a little bit down. And red increase the width a bit. And reduce the height. Yeah, this should be fine. Now you have to make this shadow look have the same color as other shadows in the background. Now to do that go to Lumetri color reduce the exposure completely. This will turn it complete black and now change the opacity to match the background color.
Now the good thing is the shadow will appear and disappear just when you appear and disappear. Since the last keyframe is 100 again, you might re remove the opacity keystroke for this shadow footage so that it stays 43 all the time. And finally add an audio when the image appears and it disappears to give the magic feeling. Now to do that I have audio here small. I'll just trim it. Put it right before it appears. Make a copy by pressing Alt and drag it to the beginning. Now if I play. That's it guys. As simple as that. You can try it at home. You don't need a green screen or anything. Just a camera and a Premiere Pro software. Try and share it on your WhatsApp and Instagram and impress your friends. Do share the link below as well in the comment section. Thanks for watching. See you in another video soon.